Devontae Davis, he comes out and uh, gives his comments on how Frank Martin is traded. He says, you know, all of those, pretty much he said, all those muscles ain't going to do nothing but stop you, bro, from swinging and it ain't going to work. My thing is this. Why would take even comment on Frank Mars physique if he isn't worried about something? If he isn't worried about there's something there that, that might affect him or might you know that he's that he's that he's a little shaky about. Right? It's kind of like when he was talking about how Ryan Garcia was too big and and then he was talking about then, then you saw how the rehydration clause came to a fact, right? And then you started hearing him bring up Devin Haney when Devin Haney knocked out, I mean, was almost almost knocked out Regis Prograde. He started talking about snack and all this other stuff because he's worried about something. When he starts saying stuff like that, he's worried about something, man. Now, a lot of people know or will, will believe that Frank Martin's going to lose this fight. Even myself, I, I think Tank stops him late with a body shot or something like that. And we, I could be all the way wrong. Y'all already know. I keep it, I keep it real, man. Like I, I just give my opinion on how I feel. Y'all know I'm not really a tank fan, but I, I see it how I see it. But at the same time, Frank Martin is a quiet is a quiet killer. One thing I did notice about Frank Martin is he's knocked down all of his opponents. I think his last four opponents, I think he knocked all of them down or knocked them out. So that is something to think about and then also uh take a minute to ring in a while so that's another thing to consider too so I'm, I'm thinking about a lot of that shit bro and then you hear take talking about frank's muscles and all that bro like that shouldn't even be on your mind worried about how that man look you should be focusing on your craft why, why does it matter like if they go work they cool then that means you go win you know if they go work why you gotta tell the world hey all that shit you do it ain't gonna work i mean it, listen it, it it could be just you know talk for the fight i get it i look at it like more than that bro because because i see a pattern with take when it comes to when he be commenting or shit like that with uh, about how a person looks during a knockout or or, or during a fight or how heavy somebody look especially if it's an opponent that he go face that he's worried about something Y'all can say what y'all want. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can say what y'all want because that's how I see it, bro. If Frank Martin can't swing because of all his muscles, then that actually helps Tank Davis, bro. You ain't got to, like, alert the world to the shit because what happens is when you open your mouth and you say shit like that, then the other fighter, your opponent, is getting like, okay, he's... he's It's like you giving your opponent intel, bro. Now he's just like, all right, you know what? This motherfucker think I'm going to go in there with all these muscles. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to lose some muscle now. Like, shit like that. Like, he, he bugging. He running his mouth too much. I think he worried about something, bro. I really do. I think I think in a lot of these fights, take me a little nervous about a lot of these fights, bro. And, you know, listen, ain't nothing wrong with being nervous, bro. Uh, Mike Tyson admitted sometimes he was scared when he went in the ring. So, being nervous is natural, bro. I wouldn't take that away from Tank. But what I'm saying is... I think he'll bring it up to the fact that Frank Mars, his muscles, is you know, that's going to be a problem for him. No, nah, man, I'm looking at it like you think it's going to be a problem for you. You know, <laughs> so we'll have to see, man. You know, let me know what y'all think about uh, Tank Davis pretty much saying all that muscle you got, Frank, ain't going to work. It ain't going to help you one bit. And he may very well be right. But why say it? Just say it, dude. I'll catch y'all later in the morning.